hi welcome to our channel uh on this channel we'll be discussing about what it's like going through high school in the finnish education and what we consider differences to other countries and their education system yeah welcome. basically our high school is starting in exactly a week so no, like six days so fair enough but you know um so yeah we'll just be i guess filming a bit beforehand and then mm-hmm. just discussing what it feels like and how we're feeling and then also while school is going on we'll be discussing the differences we experience from like middle school and high school and then just finish education in general yeah uh, we'll be going to a ib school in helsinki uh, and but yeah kind of excited yeah i'm gonna lie um so so far we have well nearly every um finnish school uh it's mandatory for you to buy like your own school books and notebooks you you have to also buy a computer since most of the material is online uh it kind of just depends on what school you're going to you know of course if you're going to an art school you buy art supplies you know basic school you just buy like notepads also since there's currently the uh covid-19 is it covid-19 <laughs> Yes, it is COVID nineteen pandemic. Yeah, since currently there's the worldwide pandemic going on, uh, I'm kind of worried about whether or not we'll be able to even go to the actual school during yeah. the start of it, or if we'll have to start straight from online school. online school at home. Uh, I don't really think I'd enjoy it that much because I we, w- we mm. had the online schooling for the last few weeks of middle school. I don't really, I didn't really enjoy it because. It made me lose my schedule, and it was I couldn't see my friends, and it was kind of more difficult to learn because you weren't actually at school, and then you know, yeah, we're not getting into yeah. that. It's also because you know it's a new school, and we uh, have trouble meeting all the new people and the teachers, mm-hmm. and getting the help we exactly need because of standing straight through online school. So yeah. I think that would be a bit problematic. I mean, I feel pretty excited, also a bit nervous, I guess. I mean, it's you a, yeah, it's a new school and it's like gonna be a lot different. So also because it's been like ten weeks since we left school, so I've kind of lost my routine and I have forgotten forgotten a lot of things. Yeah. So I am kind of excited mm-hmm. for school to start. So I I get kind of back my routine, routine and, and like yeah, there's not much else you really need to prepare for at least in Finland. Mm-hmm. Uh, I know that some schools have already started a week before us. Um, for example, like vocational school, that's already started. Yeah, and some public schools. There's not much difference with middle school and high school in Finland. I guess it's just harder, and you are more independent, mm-hmm. and you do most of your work online. Yeah. So. The teaching is more like uh your it's your choice to like. You know, if you want to learn, you got to put in the effort. The teachers aren't gonna like push you yeah. that much. Of course, they will try and support you in whichever in whatever way, but it really just comes down to whether or not you're willing to work hard for, for the you know, um, final grades. So today we went to see the new renovated building because our school had a renovation during the summer. Well, so. it's been going on for a maybe a f- yeah a few years. Yeah, uh, they're only gonna be finishing the renovation in, in December. The oh, yeah, at the end of the year. Uh, it was nice. It took us maybe around twenty minutes to get yeah. there. We took the train, train, and, and then the tram. tram. Yeah. yeah, and I mean it's a lot faster the way than our old school. Yeah, it takes it takes less time to get there than our old yeah. school. Uh, it was pretty chill. It was yeah. a, it was a nice building. I really yeah. liked it. It was. It, it's right near the city center, so it's really good because it there's like a couple of shopping centers right next to it and yeah, stuff. As you can see, we're following the recommendations our government has given us by wearing the masks, as all of you should as well. So don't be shy, wear those masks. In Finland, um, you you will see a lot of like, I don't know, a seven year olds going to school. There'll be a lot of young kids. On the public transport, yeah. going to school. I mean, here, you know, even in first grade, the parents give the phone and say, like, mobile phone, and are like, okay, go to school. So it's, you you get a lot of 
trust and respect and like responsibility freedom. and yeah freedom at a really young age so uh no one really drives to school unless it's like a special occasion or you know if people just willingly drive you to school uh so there's, and there's no school buses here everyone yeah. just take, uses public transport uh, but most schools at least middle schools uh give free bus cards to students so they don't yeah. have to pay for their trips but uh they don't pay for them anymore in high school so we'll yeah. have to I think they them. only give you a free like bus card if you live like ten kilometers away from the school. Yeah. Uh yes. And I think in middle school it's if you live four kilometers yeah. away, then they give you the free mm-hmm. bus card. I'm not really sure how the school year is gonna go. Hopefully I'm pre- yeah hopefully it's gonna go well. And we don't have to start our first few months of high school through like online schooling because that yeah. would be a shame. also i uh, i wish we wouldn't but i'm pretty sure we're going to end up having to wear masks at school yeah. our school has sent us uh, an email about the corona situation and how they're going to be following the guidelines that the government gives us and yeah. just to stay safe and wash our hands and all that stuff Right now I'm feeling a bit, you know, excited. Yeah. It really hasn't hit me yet. Like I still haven't like realized that I'm going to go back to school in such a like so soon cuz I still feel like it's summer. So I uh, the realization hasn't really hit me yet and I'm kind of nervous for when it does. Yeah, no, definitely after 10 weeks of no school, it kind of doesn't really hit me properly yet, but we'll see. That is all for now. We'll see how we feel in the next few days yeah. before school starts. See ya. Okay. Hi guys. Yes. It's the day before school starts. Yay. We got our books and computers today, you know. Yeah. Better like than never. So we have the maths book. Then we have our theory of knowledge talk book, which is yeah. heavy. And then our history from national geographic look how thick our books are what there's like some maths book and there's like what 554 pages that's gonna be fun so yeah most of our books are online so we only had to purchase these three yeah so Uh, in the future in the next like the years after this we'll also have to buy more books depending Mm -hmm. on the subjects we take so yeah less than 24 hours till school school starts starts again and then we're gonna have Work. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. I'm excited. That that's all for today. See you tomorrow. Yeah. So today's our first day. So we're gonna go now.